All right, I'm here at the University of Bath table and uh, Hannah is going to explain uh, what this thing is. Okay, this is called a double pendulum or a chaotic pendulum. Yep. So the idea is that your regular pendulum, like you'd see in a grandfather clock, has really regular behaviour. It yep. just, it's, you know it's predictable, you know what it's going to do and that's why we use it to tell time. The idea of this is that it's a pendulum attached to a pendulum and that we can't predict its behaviour once it's from a certain angle. So, once it starts moving, so if I, 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 I quite like, I'll start it like this, right? Okay. If I set that swinging, there's no way we can predict what it's doing now. There's no way we can predict what it's doing now, and you can notice there's no regular pattern to it. And we could try setting it off from the exact same point, and it wouldn't do the same thing, because in fact we're not setting it off from the so exact if I, same point. Again, because that's ever so slightly different, yeah. that's going to do a whole different thing now. Yeah, it did the loop, the loop that time. And how, how are the kids enjoying it today? The kids are really liking it. We're asking them to predict what they think it's going to do, and most of them are really surprised by the way it behaves. That's fantastic. <laughs> that's predictable now. Oh, no. oh I stopped. <laughs> So here we have exactly the same idea of the double pendulum, but this is uh, more of an a, uh, exhibition model where kids can come up by themselves and set this thing running and then just marvel at that chaotic motion. You just don't know where this pendulum's going to swing next.